1. Leah Ramini Leah Ramini, the most outspoken former celebrity Scientologist, dedicated herself to revealing the alleged wrongdoings of the organization after she quit in 2013. Her memoir Troublemaker, Surviving Hollywood and Scientology was released in 2015, and her docuseries Leah Ramini, Scientology and the Aftermath premiered the following year. Ramini conducted three seasons interviewing ex-Scientologists and their families with the assistance of former high-ranking church member Mike Rinder. During its existence, the show received two Emmys. 2. Laura Prepon Laura Prepon, a star from Orange is the New Black and That 70s Show, announced in August 2021 that she had left Scientology and hadn't been affiliated with it for years. Being a mother taught her that something can work out for a period of time and then you move on and evolve from that, she said. I'm no longer practicing Scientology, Prepon explained. I've always been very open-minded, even since I was a child. I was raised Catholic and Jewish. I've prayed in churches, meditated in temples. I haven't practiced Scientology in close to five years and it's no longer part of my life. 3. Paul Haggis Paul Haggis, who directed and wrote the screenplay for Crash, which also won the Best Picture Oscar in 2005, has been a committed and active church member for 35 years. In response to a San Diego branch member signing a petition in favor of California's Proposition 8, which attempted to restrict marital equality, he formally severed ties with Scientology in 2008. Three women anonymously accused Haggis of assault in 2018, and he has vehemently denied their claims. 4. Jason Lee Actor Jason Lee, who you may recognize from various comedies by Kevin Smith and the sitcom My Name is Earl, apparently joined Scientology in the 1990s. After relocating to Denton, Texas, with his wife Jaren Alkik, he casually revealed in a 2016 interview that he was no longer a Scientologist. If Jaren and I had an idea for a business, it certainly wouldn't happen at the cost of someone else's, he told. And being that we don't practice Scientology, and that we aren't particularly interested in opening religious centers in general, we have no plans to open a Scientology center. 5. Katie Holmes Although Katie Holmes never formally identified as a Scientologist, she was married to Tom Cruise for six years, the organization's most prominent member and ambassador. Their lavish 2006 wedding in Italy featured a Scientology ceremony that was attended by several influential church members. Holmes hasn't been associated with the church in any obvious ways since her breakup with Cruise. 6. Mimi Rogers Though it is believed that Cruise's first wife, Mimi Rogers, was the one to introduce him to the church, he remained active there for a longer period of time than she did. Although Roger hasn't publicly expressed her opposition to the religion, there have been rumors that she didn't like the controversial church leader David Miscavige, who would serve as the best man during Cruise and Holmes' nuptials. 7. Lisa Marie Presley At one point, both Lisa Marie Presley and her mother Priscilla Presley were outspoken about their involvement with Scientology. She did, however, acknowledge in 2012 that she had abandoned the religion, in part due to the impact she felt it had on her daily life. I got bad advice. I was insulated with no grip on reality, she said. They were taking my soul, my money, my everything. 8. Neil Gaiman Neil Gaiman, a writer of fantasy novels, was raised in a Scientology home and even gave an interview about the religion when he was just seven years old. But he has refuted assertions that he was never a member as an adult on numerous occasions, 